Now, just to give you guys a little bit of context, I was not scheduled to do a video today. In fact, I just had shoulder surgery a few days ago and I'm not even supposed to be really moving my arm that much. But when the doorbell rang this morning and the FedEx guy showed up and I saw this package and I saw what was inside this package, I said, shoulder and schedule be damned. I am doing this video because I am that excited about this product and that product is Recoil. Now, before we start, you guys need to know this is not a paid ad. It is not a sponsored piece. The folks at Skyrocket who make Recoil were kind enough to send us this review unit, but all opinions that I'm sharing are mine and mine alone, but we do really appreciate Skyrocket getting this into our hands. So, where do we start? Oh, Recoil, how do I do you justice? The best way to explain Recoil to you is, think of the best features of laser tag mixed with live action Call of Duty, mixed in with augmented reality using your mobile device. And now you'll start to get an idea of what Recoil is all about. I used to take my kids all the time to play laser tag and they'd always encourage the adults to play. First problem is, there aren't that many places, at least not around me, not that many places to play laser tag around where I live. The second problem is because there aren't that many of them, the few that there are around my neighborhood are always incredibly crowded. The third limitation is that they're almost always indoors. And although they can do a lot of fun things with neon lighting and cute little obstacles, you're still limited to an indoor environment. And the last thing about laser tag that's not really great is that when I play, I tend to behave very unattractively. I mean really unattractively. Like using kids as human shields and barking out orders to seven-year-olds unattractively. So recoil really takes all the negatives out of the world of laser tag and adds so much more to it. Because every starter set, and we're gonna be unboxing the starter set in a minute, every set that you get has its own portable Wi-Fi unit that creates a virtual battlefield around you that works in conjunction with an app that you can download for free that works on your smartphone. So basically, wherever you go, someone's backyard, go to the beach, go to a local park, that can become your new outdoor playground, complete with its own respawn point for when you die. You know, enough talking, let's unbox this sucker and I'll tell you more as we go along. Okay, so while I'm getting recoil out of its box with my incredibly lame unboxing knife, let me give you some information. You can have up to 8v8 in this game. Eight versus eight, up to 16 people playing at the same time. Uh, the starter kit comes with two weapons, uh, two of the, uh, what is it called? The RK-45 Spitfire. Yes, yeah, so you get two of the RK-45 Spitfire, which are the pistols. Then of course you get the Wi-Fi game hub and the sensors and all that other great stuff. That Wi-Fi game hub that I told you about, it creates a battlefield of up to 500 feet in diameter. So we're talking a really huge space that you guys can use to play your game. So yeah, I mean, it, the expandability is great. They also sell extra weapons separately the SR-15 Rogue Rifle. Now, I didn't get a chance to play with the rifle. I only got a chance to actually use the pistol, the, the two pistols that are in here. And I gotta tell you, I can't wait to get my hands on the rifle. It looked fantastic. There's also a frag grenade that you can get to use in battle that you can roll out onto the battlefield and use your, you know, using your phone. You can watch it explode and take out enemies. So cool. Recoil, the world is now a game. Look at this, they also have, okay, these are, I guess, AR ground markers that they include eight of them. Interesting. I, didn't, I don't remember these from when I actually played, but I have to read the instructions and find out exactly how to use these guys. I have to also thank the folks at Recoil. They included a bunch of batteries for me for both the Wi-Fi hub and the weapons. The other thing they included, and we didn't really talk about this, is earbuds, two pair of earbuds. Now, why are earbuds important? Because there's another feature I didn't mention, and that is because it uses your mobile device and this whole tied in connected sort of community to play the game, you can actually talk to your teammates. You plug the headphones into your weapon and then there's a button that you can press on the weapon that lets you have comms with your teammates. How cool is that? The other great thing that the audio does, by using your headphones, and they gave me these, but you can use any of your own headphones that have a 3.5 millimeter jack. When you're using your headphones, it gives you 3D spatial audio. Why is that important? Because if you hear somebody firing from behind you off to the side, if, even if you can't see them, you can hear where they are thanks to this high-end audio, this 3D spatial audio that's used. They really thought of everything with this. I'm cutting each weapon out. And if you haven't guessed by now by the name Recoil, all the weapons in the game actually do have physical recoil when you fire. 
you can actually get the, the kickback, when it, which adds a whole bunch of more of it, not just reality, but more immersion into the game. It feels like you're really in the game. Okay, now here, this is, I always, I always get the names wrong, the RK45 Spitfire. Now, I'm going to show this to you right here. Get an idea of what it looks like. Ouch. Sorry about that. What you can't feel is that this weapon has a nice real heft to it. It isn't so heavy that you can't one-hand it, obviously, especially when you think about the fact you're going to have to put the cradle on here that holds your phone and have your cell phone. And I, ha I happen to have an iPhone 7 Plus, so it's pretty heavy, but this weapon has a really nice feel in the hand. On its own, it has a nice presence, and I, I never like gadgets that are too light. I feel if they're too light, there's not enough in them to make them really cool gadgets. So this one, it's balanced really well. It feels really comfortable in the hand, but it, it definitely has a nice presence. You can tell there's some good innards in here, especially because it has to have that recoil effect. So you know they had to build that in here as well, a nice little motor. And uh, you'll see it has the rail and a sight right at the top there. And I got to tell you, these sights are dialed in really well. When you play a game of recoil, I was picking off people across the map, including this one kid who still might be upset weeks later, but he was fair game, he was in the game, he had a weapon, you could shoot him. Um, you're able to really shoot across the map here at, with great accuracy, so don't think that these sights are just there as a gimmick, they're really dialed in well. The bottom here, you'll see a little button, that is how you just reload. Now after a while, just like any video game where you run out of magazines, you're gonna have to eventually go get more magazines of ammo, and that happens at your respawn point, which the game will generate using augmented reality and GPS tied into your, you know, the mobile Wi-Fi here. And uh, you'll see on your phone where you have to go to respawn. It's really cool. Yeah, my doctor is really going to be ticked off. I mean, I should not be doing this. Okay, so there you go. You get the two pistols, right? Now, you also get, this is really clever. You also get that cradle that I was talking about to, to put your cell phone in. I can tell you, once these attach to, oh look, and they're, they're rubberized too, so they will not leave a mark on your phone. Once these actually attach to the weapon, and that I do believe they go on the side here, once they attach to your weapon, your phone does not move. I had, they had an iPhone attached to mine. Not only didn't it wiggle, but it never moved. So having it fall out, not an issue. The folks over at Recoil are actually over at Skyrocket. Uh, they were really careful to make sure that people felt safe and comfortable putting their very precious device on the weapon they're going to be using to be playing a game. So don't worry about it. I never had any issue. They said they've never had one person. The hundreds of people that have tested this never had an issue. So you can feel comfortable that these, these cradles really do work well. So there are two of these, the wearable sensors. This is another way you wear this on your back. So I think it goes on, maybe it goes onto your pants there. Anyway, the sensor will let people know, let you, know, let you shoot people and they can get feedback. And by the way, when you get shot, uh, you can feel the feedback on your weapon. So you not only do you feel the feedback when you're shooting, when you're getting shot, you can feel it. And you can also see yourself losing life on the app. It's way cool. The Wi-Fi Game Hub. Now I have to put the batteries in and set everything up, but basically this is what creates, it's got a little antenna here. It looks like a tiny portable router. This is what creates the battlefield in conjunction with your mobile device. They work in tandem using the GPS with your phone, the Wi-Fi signal here, it creates this great virtual battlefield. And again, this can be taken anywhere. I mean, I, I even can see something in the future where, you know, maybe we use augmented reality headsets at some point. Uh, now, the next time you see us using this, I'm not going to be smiling. I'm going to have my game face on. Uh, hopefully not using anyone as a human shield, child or otherwise. We are going to be using this and playing with it to give you a more detailed hands-on. We just wanted to give you sort of a quick look at what recoil is how cool it is, what the concept behind it is. Again, huge thanks to the folks at Skyrocket for setting us up with this. If you like the video, feel free to give us a thumbs up. If you want to see us do more of these types of unboxings or if there's anything more you want to learn about either Skyrocket or Recoil, let us know that with a comment below. And don't forget to subscribe because when you subscribe, you make yourself instantly eligible for all of our giveaways. So that's it for now. I've got some adults to go after. No kids, I told you.